So, block strap. The Roblox extension or like plugin you can say. I don't really know how to describe it. Okay, I'm gonna read the Google definition. An open source feature packed alternative bootstrapper for Roblox. Yeah, that's what it is basically. <laughs> and it allows you to customize some Roblox settings that aren't in the original player beta app or the Windows app technically. I don't really know. And after watching Shark Blocks' video, I got an idea to make a doors themed avatar editor background would that look cool um let's find out i guess all right so i open up the blocks right menu let's go to the mod section open mods folder over here all right here we are in the modification folder all i gotta do is press the extra content and places and this is and mobile.rbxl this is basically the roblox mobile awata editor background like it was so long ago and really nostalgia filled i guess all right i'm gonna show you guys um i don't know what's with this arrow over here this place can be loaded wait seriously is it because it needs updating come on bro this is not the time <laughs> all right since i opened the roblox player beta app or the windows okay i should stop saying that i should just choose Choose one the windows app all right i'm just gonna show you guys what it looks like so right now this is basically the background which is the current one and not the old mobile one i'm just gonna enable this over here and if i save and relaunch the roblox windows app i think i'll be able to see the mobile background well crap Yep, there we go. Sorry about that. You can't just launch the base Roblox player app. <laughs> you gotta launch it from the block strap one. How do I minimize this again? Oh flip. <laughs> I really don't know how to use this. I wanna zoom into this area here. Oh, there we go. Yeah, look at this. I don't know why it's kind of laggy right now. And you can use right click to even move around. I don't know why it's lagging though. Maybe it's just high quality. I don't really know. I'm sorry. All right, since this file is a Roblox place, that means we could technically go and edit it. There we go. We'd like to upgrade, uh, I guess so. I don't really know if that would break anything. Now look at this, bro. You literally can edit it. All right, so uh, all this stuff over here, we could technically delete it. But one thing that we need over here is the alignment. All right, transparency, gotta, there we go. Because this is where your character spawns. This is really important to keep in the place. Okay, I might have to like, put an arrow to know where it is. Is. I'm gonna delete this. There we go. Let's put like this thing over here. Pa boom. And put like an arrow, I guess. I learned this from Shark Blocks. Ha ha ha. Arrow in the images. There we go. Like um like this. So we won't lose track of the direction. All right, we can start now. I think. All right. Okay. Let's start with a door wall.
Alright, we are technically kind of done here, I think. I just think I'm gonna make it invisible. Now it's gonna show it up. And that would be pretty, pretty bad. Got this one, yep. Turn up to one. There we go, it's invisible now. And uh, the floor, I think I'm gonna readjust it since it's kind of in the wrong direction right now, I guess. Well, that's as much better as it could get, honestly. All right, you know what? Um, I'm gonna gambit and hope that the script doesn't activate when I uh, test this out. All right, the doors, uh, theme, background, yes. There we go. All right, now, since we both this, we only need one, so. Uh, okay, wait, before I do, I need to um, turn this off, I think. It's gonna break the thing. Right, so all I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna cut this away and put it somewhere else. All right, guys, the moment of truth. Does it actually work? Oh no. Oh no. Okay, all right. Maybe I made a mistake. I think I have to turn on the mobile thing. Yeah, hold on, hold on. Oh, what? Oh no. Oh, I hope it didn't replace my file or anything. Crap, crap, crap. Oh, it just adds it back in. I'm gonna rename the file. Alright, I don't know if this would fix this. Please, bro, please. Bro, it just... Alright guys, so I remade the whole map again. I hope this time it works. Okay, before I do actually attempt this again, I'm gonna anchor everything if I can. Yeah, I feel like it's gonna fall apart if I don't anchor, right? Alright, so I watched Sharkbox's video again and um, turn this off, alright? Gotta turn this off. What lock? What is that? Bro, for some reason, documents doesn't appear. I, I don't know why, this is so stupid. This is making me angry. Now it should work if I were to open the mods folder and then. There we go. And then rename this, alright? Rename it to mobile. Please work. Oh my god, bro. Please work. Oh my god. Um, guys. <laughs> yeah. Uh... Okay, it works, alright. I just uh, need to do some more changing. Oh my god, this is scary. This should work. I don't know why there's so many music in the background. Oh my god, it's definitely the scripts, bro. It's definitely the scripts, let me tell you that. It's still there. I. This is not okay. There we go. <laughs> Yeah, it works all right. Oh yeah, my flashlight fell. <laughs> this is good. Come on, I'm gonna look. Except for the weird music, all right? Just don't listen to that. All right, so yeah, um, if you scroll a little bit, you can see the door over there and the exit door you can't really see, which is kind of sad. Yeah, comment down below how great this is. Don't don't listen to the music. <laughs> is it gonna get worse if I stay here longer, I feel? Okay, I'm done here. See ya.